Hi, I'm Timothea Howard. I'm a board member for the Nuclear Information and Resource Service. And I want to talk to all of you, my friends and peers and comrades, about contributing to the NEARS Legacy Fund. I know that we're all involved in social justice. I know that we all have our causes. We all have the things that we believe in. But I've been a member and a board member of NEARS for almost 10 years. And the reason I joined this board is because I needed to know more about the larger picture of things that could, in fact, impact us as we do our work. One of them is the unbridled and unprincipled use of nuclear power and also nuclear products. I wanted to be a part of the board that really was examining those things and keeping their eye on the ball. Right now, NEARS has been in, in existence for almost 40 years. And we created a legacy fund in the name of Michael Marriott, who is our executive director, to continue that work. We know now from the accidents that have happened at Chernobyl and at Fukushima, we cannot afford to simply surrender our future to corporations and to governments around something as difficult and as explosive as nuclear energy. I'm asking all of you to consider making a contribution to the NEARS Legacy Fund. This is important work because in the end, while we're doing all of our social justice work and we may win many victories, and I know we will, it can all be undone by a nuclear accident. That is something that we do not want to have happen. We want to be on top of what is all of the things that could impact our work and our lives and the people that we care about and the world that we're trying to build. So I want you to seriously consider making a contribution, no matter how small. This is not about you busting the budget, you know, giving up your light money, all that kind of stuff. It's really about making a small contribution to an ongoing legacy fund that will help to continue this necessary work for a nuclear-free future and also for a clean world and a better world for all of us. Thank you.